at the at a very funny place. It <laughs> was <laughs> there's this show uh back at home mm-hmm. where we went. Uh then we both freestyled and I was like, damn, this kid dope. So like mm-hmm. we hooked up, then later we like I gave him a beat and he said like with one week with the beat, then he came and told me like, Yo, I did the beat, uh I have a verse. So he like, Okay, drop it. Then after dropping the beat, uh, I I've said that we we have our own like our home studio. So like Wait, before you even continue, you you saw him perform? Yeah. Actually it was on a freestyle. We were we were battling okay. actually. We battled together on the mm-hmm. freestyle. Uh so after that I was like, Okay, this gig got flow and everything. And he told you he already has a beat. Yeah, no, I was the one who was having oh, the beat. Oh, you were the one having yeah, the so beat. Yeah, so I okay. gave him the you beat. You were ready? Yeah, I was ready. Mm-hmm. So I gave him the beat. Uh he stayed with it like one week. Mm-hmm. Then he reached out and he was like, Hey I gotta this this th- this is what I have. So he laid it down. Mm-hmm. Then after laying it down, we listened and was like, Oh then the chorus just came. Then I started writing. Then after that, we just started recording. So it became the magic happened. Yeah. Magic yeah. happened. Yeah. What is the, what was the theme behind Sinus? What is what, what what is the story you're trying to tell people? Yeah. Uh, okay. Sinus mm-hmm. was a track we did. You look li- like you see Christians, mm-hmm. like Wakiskia Squirrel the Kid, is always doing secular music. So this time around, I'm actually a Sinus. Born at 22. You see. So like Sinus, you see people. People are judged by the way. So like. They want to like um you see in a in an instant, let me see. I'm tensing by the way, so <laughs> this <laughs> is my okay. first time on TV. Doesn't so um mm-hmm. yeah, the seen us we did cause um you find like Pasi, Pali Church. Yes. Anakonanga Anakonanga Church, yes. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And when on our devoted, you do church stuff, you do everything. Mm-hmm. Then okay, and your friends know you're a freak. You you just you know that person they think. So seen as we did to convince people that actually Konzal is title seen as secular person doing a song called Sinus. Yes. Yeah. So like we wanted that people to get to get what can I say? Um to get like wh- why 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 seen us like mm. I don't know how to explain it more, but I'll let you. You want to get rid of the idea of people just <laughs> yeah, judging you because of how you look or how you express yourself. Yeah, in short, that is exactly what I'm talking about. <laughs> Lovely. Because it happens a lot, especially for the young people, because we want to express ourselves the way we know how to and the way we feel like to. But people out there just tend to judge us because they don't really understand who we are, where we come from, how we grew up. And uh, things just tend to go haywire. True. Yes. What? Why? Why did you? Uh, you guys went to studio and wrote lyrics together, definitely. Yes. Yeah. Who was the producer behind this? Us. <laughs> you we guys were the producer. Actually, the album. Music. Yeah, okay. yeah. The album. The entire album. I produced it myself. Yeah. That speaks and volume because young people tend to say. I can't produce. I can't uh, go to the studio because I don't have these. I don't have. How did you? When I mean these, these I mean like in terms of finances, uh, to pay a, pay for a session at the studio, True. pay a, a direct pay a producer, sorry, and then there also the engineer, sound engineer, to just come up with a beat for you. I would like you to tell guys back at home who are looking forward to get into the not only hip hop uh, music but any sort of any sound of kind of music. How do you go about it? And yet I don't have the finances um, to back me up. Actually, wh- when we started this stuff with ticking here, mm-hmm. we had nothing, so we had to like went to like assholes, we get small like to na save, then we buy stuff. So like us, Silasma, mm-hmm. Silasma to when they call magic anger, Silasma when they call Rico beats, mm-hmm. you can do this. Like me Nilan production, but Sikonda Shule. Yes. Actually YouTube. YouTube is a very good school. So like if you're out there and you think like Lasma when they call producer, you can if you have passion in music you can do it yourself. It's I love the fact that you've also said that y- b- b- the both of you set aside uh, a particular amount of money. That means you prioritize whatever you had in mind, which is music. Yeah. You had to prioritize that. And you had to put in finances pertaining that. Yeah. So you guys are full time mus- mu- putting in effort, your time into music. Uh, not really. Like for me, uh, I'm actually working. Okay. Yeah. That's a new one because most of the artists <laughs> when they come here, we're like, "What else do you do f- apart from music?" They're like, "No, music full time. It's business full no, time." No, actually, for me, yes. I would like it to be music full time. But as as, as you say, like yeah. I told you earlier, we are having our own, our own home studio. Mm-hmm. And like it's something that we are creating. Maybe in future, it's gonna be big. Actually, it's gonna be big. Uh, I love so the spirit. Yeah, it's gonna be big. Yes. So, what we do, like I work, I work like 
for for eight eight to ten hours a day mm -hmm. then you come back home like you have to do music you like until time for what four you love. like four in the morning yes. then you like sleep two or three hours then you go back to work again i you love see, the dedication see like it's only dedication yes. actually that's what you do you fight for what you believe in mm -hmm. like for some time you might not have the money but you have to work for someone who has the money mm -hmm. so that you can create your own and invest in yeah. what you actually True. love but some people are actually lazy they don't want to do that mm -hmm. so they're like mm -hmm. but sometimes you have to humble yes. true and it's also said that if you fight for your dream your dream will fight for you mm -hmm. so like just do whatever you have to do to make that thing right how many are yeah Okay, still into the music scene. You guys are doing amazing, and I'm seeing you guys go quite far because thank I'm you, looking at the you, planning you. that you have and the ambition. Uh, let's look at two artists that you like to collaborate with in Kenya when you talk about the hip hop music scene. Two each or two like? You can let's let's go by two two. Okay. Yes. Uh, okay, I'll go first. I'd like to work with uh, oh this woman Mudoni, the drama queen. And I'd also like to work with Wangeshi. Wherever you are, man, I'd like to work with you. Yeah. Wangeshi, <laughs> I know you, you I know you'll get this. Um, I'm Squirrel the Kid official KE on Instagram yes. and everywhere. Offic Squirrel the Kid official KE. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. 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 Kagwe Mungai. Kagwe Mungai. There you go. I'd like to work with you too. What about you, Tiking? Hey, uh, for actually, we just want to comment. Kagwe is a genius, by the way. Kagwe genius. Mungai is a genius. Mm -hmm. Big, big and, shout and, out. And this guy, Naiboy. Naiboy. Naiboy is also a genius. I love the fact that you're also mentioning people who are not in the hip hop music. So yeah, Naiboy. They're influencing. Like for your me personally, I, I just sit okay. down and listen to uh, Naiboy's music and I'm like, mm -hmm. people are underrating his music. Like literally, people are underrating his music. They like underestimate yeah, him. Yeah, yeah. Like it's, it's from way back when he was uh, rap down. Rap down. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Uh, for me, I would like to work with Wangeshi too. Actually, I've reached out to you, Wangeshi, but Adarudisha, <laughs> <laughs> I've, I've <laughs> emailed. Email. So email. So email. 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 <laughs> now, now she will. Email. Now yeah. she will. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, I would also want to work with uh, Nashinsky. 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 And okay. I'll be If I get a chance with Saudi Soul, damn, I think. Okay, I love the fact that both of you are not just uh, dwelling on uh, the general of genre of hip hop in terms of people who actually influence the sound of music, but you're going as far as different genres, and we're looking forward to have more music from you guys. And yeah. please, after you have released any other sound, make sure you drop it here. Uh, are we looking forward to see your official videos? Yeah, actually, we are working on one. Mm -hmm. The the song is called Young Eme, one of the songs in the album. Mm -hmm. So like the video is dropping soon. Mm -hmm. And I hope y'all will subscribe to that channel. Yeah. Okay. Finally, it's all, um, it's we're almost wrapping it all up. DJ Regis, how about you tell us what do you think uh, about these guys? Because I feel like they have a long way to go, and they're oh. actually doing amazing. Considering that Squirrel has an album already, an EP, and this guy is starting off, but he's doing an amazing. First of all, mm. an album, Sim Yes. <laughs> and you're an answer. So good work. Definitely. Actually, mm -hmm. all the work, I want to big up my brother because he's the CEO of the small company we're starting. So, like, everything, like the Yo, studio. You guys didn't mention that this was, it is all your company. You yeah, yeah, that actually, is it's, our, you put it's that ours. Out there. It's ours. Okay. We, did, we did everything from scratch, like, but he's the CEO. I'm the co-CEO. You guys, back <laughs> at home, you have to ensure that you follow these guys up because they have much to give you. And you can definitely ask questions and we hopefully that you respond. Yeah. And you can also mentor also young people who are looking forward to get into the hip-hop music scene. Not only just hip-hop genre, but other form of of sound. My name is Michelle. My name is Michelle Ashira. Thank you for watching this. But before I leave you, I would like you guys to give out your social media handles. And if we can, you can drop a little bit of something. Yes, seeing as will be nice. Yes. Go uh, ahead. For me, it's a uh, ticking official. For me, it's a uh, ticking official. Mm -hmm. uh, in uh, WhatsApp, uh, Facebook, ticking official. Instagram is ticking official Kenya. Okay. Yeah. Um, I'm Squirrel the Kid. I'm scared of the kid, official KE everywhere. Twitter, Facebook, um, Instagram. This is in Guinea. <laughs> Across all yeah. social media platforms. Yeah. There you yeah. go, guys. And, uh, Make sure you follow yeah. them and they will have some good stuff coming your way. But don't move because we have another session of good music courtesy of our own residential DJ, DJ Regis. And
and another interview coming your way but for now you guys can perform because we cannot wait to hear those flows of lines thank you thank you